steak froze rose paoli different cheesesteak 1191 i liked it good pieces sarcone's roll and this roll the bread was light and airy so it wasn't like a typical dense sarcone's roll still had the great flavor big roll got cooper sharp a lot of cooper sharp very well melted all through everything the meat when i tasted it it was good we need to work on the meat to bread ratio and i told mike that so i'm not being a karen you see in the pictures this is, this is bread, cheese, and some meat. And the fried onions, I don't, I don't think I like the big pieces of fried onions. I think uh, you got three other good things. Let those other things go. Let those other things run the show. Paoli at night. Steak bros. Ended up here. Heard good things about steak bros. Figure I'd check them out. Might go to Locust Lane Brewing down there. I don't know, 12 minutes away. I might just go home. I'm a miserable old man. Quincy Lobster Rolls. I got caught up in the moment. I got lobster mac and cheese. Huh, look at that. Auto, uh... Auto, uh, light. For night videoing. All right, so overall it's good. I'm surprised it's, it's a it's a it is a sarcone roll, which I always thought were too dense for cheesesteaks. But boy, this looks like they. Uh, I don't know if they, I don't know if they're doing something different for cheesesteaks, or I got a light one. But this one's pretty airy. But I mean, you can see. It, there's a lot of bread. Bread to meat. And I think bread's winning that. All right, so I'm gonna pick that off of there. Stick that over there. You see plenty of cheese. Got plenty of cheese. Big diced onions. A lot of big flavors, and uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I think the meat might, I think the meat might be getting a little lost in here. I mean, just granted, that's a lot of meat. I don't know. So if I shove that back in there, I pick a little bit of meat up. Well, a little bit of meat I've tasted, I liked. It's really good. I think we got a little ratio problem. Straighten that out. I think we've got a good cheesesteak here.